Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode today on Roblox. My name is Digi and today I'm going to be showing you guys all the badges in the game called Trevor Creatures The Trevor Legends. Also, it's my birthday. Say happy birthday in the comments. Say it now. Tell me happy birthday. Train ether. The subway ether? Bro, I love subway sandwiches. Italian BMC. <laughs> so good. All right, so what we want to do is head this way where the lava map and the snow map are. This little corner over here is where you want to go. You can kind of see in the distance right over there, there it looks like a little rectangular cube. That is what we are going to. So I'll see you guys in a few seconds. All right, so here is the spot we want to be. What we want to do is go ahead, climb up this wall or jump, go inside, and suddenly there's no subway. But there's a big giant piece of meat there. I don't, don't. <laughs> just go ahead and touch the big red cube, the meat cube. Touch it. Glowing cat. Find him. Don't worry, kitty cat. I'll find you. I am fireman. So what we want to do go into the map like so. What you then want to do is go to the town over here, all right? If you can't see it, just follow along where I'm going, and I'll see you guys in a few seconds. All right, so once you're in the town of nobody, of nowhere land, you're going to see a black door over there. You've guessed it. That is where the badge is going to be. It is really simple to find. It just might be difficult for those who do not have high graphic settings and can't see far away. All you got to do, though, is simply walk inside, bump into the morph, and you'll get glowing kitty cat. We did it. We saved the cat lady's cat. Shy Guy SCP. Find Shy Guy statue. So to get this, we want to do, go ahead into the map like so. Oh, there's Murray. And what you're going to do is head towards the snow area, all right? So we're going to walk this way, but we're not going to go into the snow area itself. We're going to be going to the edge of it right here and the edge of the map. So I'm going to go ahead and speed this up a bit. I'll see you guys in a few seconds. All right, and as you can see, Shy Guy is right there, frozen in time. Oh no, Shy Guy, don't be shy, it's okay. It's me, I'm Digi. I'm a good friend of your SCP friends. No need to be shy. I'm great with people, as I stand on his face. All right, and to get the Godzilla badge is actually going to be in the lobby. So right over here, you can go up this ladder here. You see it right there between the Godzilla badge and Ghidorah. This is what we want to climb up on. And just wait. You wait and see. Bro, this is going to blow your mind. You're going to climb it. That's right. We're going to climb the ladder here. And go over. And then to the back side. And voila, look, there's a little mini Godzilla morph. Look at it. Touch it. And now it's your pet Godzilla. You can also just, you know, go around the back this way. <laughs> you don't have to go up the ladder. Ghidorah, the electricity monster. So, to get this badge, what we want to do is go into the map like so. Once you do that, what we want to do is find the snow map and go towards the right side, okay? And we're going to head this way, and it's going to be sort of in the corner right over here. I'm just going to speed it up just a bit. So I'll see you guys in a few seconds. Alright, so right here is the area you want to be in. And you can't miss it. It is right here. It is bright and yellow and electrifying. Is that Jerry? Award, Jerry the Cartoon Dog. What? No way! It's Jerry! Jerry the cartoon dog. Jerry the cartoon dog. Alright, 
Anyways, go into... Oh, hello. Go into the map. Now, once you're here, you've got the snow biome to your left. And you want to go to this small building over this way. Right over here. Now, a lot of you might remember, this is the same way to the dream badge. However, it is not going to be there exactly. It's going to be past the small building. And you might be able to see in the distance, that little rectangle over on the horizon. That is the direction we are going towards. But if you have not gotten the dream badge right over there, you see that green box? That's the dream badge. So if you want, you can pop on by, grab that, and then go and continue on to this spot right here. You don't need to be a flyer or any super speed badge morph, but if you want to, go for it. You know, I'm just showing this that it is possible to do it without any morphs. Now, I have not experienced any badges that require a badge morph to get it. Not yet, though. Those are the tricky ones because you have to get a badge to get another badge. So here we go. Just jump up. And then we're going to drop down into here and bump into... <laughs> looks like a french fry. <laughs> Where's the ketchup? Dream? Dream is speed running in Minecraft. Yeah, but he cheated. Or so they say. I don't know. I don't care. I don't watch him. Anyways, be a human or a morph. Whatever you want to be. Now, what we want to do is go this way to this building. You don't want to go to the snow. You do not want to go to the lava. You don't want to go that way. You want to go this way. Where you see this pathway right there. Just go ahead and follow it until you get to the building. And as you can see, it's really not that far. So there's no need to speed up. Isn't that amazing? We get to chit chat together. I'm speed running, by the way. Look how fast I'm going. Pshoo! I'm so fast. I'm faster than the speed of light. Right, Kevin? I'm so fast. I know. Oof. I'm so fast. I didn't even give him time to answer. I'm that. So I'm sped. Thank you. Now, once you're here in front of the building, you're going to see this green cube. As you can guess, that is what we need to touch or go into it. And there we go. Dream. The black, red, blue soul. Find the soul that is giving the creature of soul. I don't know what any of that means, but go ahead into the map. You do not need to be anything specific. Now, once you're here in the spawn spot, go ahead and look for this building. You want to go down this pathway over here. Now, it's not at the building, but it is a good marker to show where to go. And then from there, you want to go to another spot. So I'm going to go ahead and speed this up a bit. So then you can see where it is. Alright, so once you're in the right corner of the map, you're going to go up this landmass and go right over here and then drop on down and you will then go forward, bumping into these um, floating balls. Baby Planet Rome. Oh, a word, little Rome. Oh, the guy sent by noticed me. Alright, go into the map. And once you do, you're going to go to the lava map or biome and that is going to be this way towards the weird shape mountain it kind of looks like a finger it's just like this it's like eh, it's a hook yeah now we're gonna go ahead and speed up so i'll see you guys in a few seconds All right, so this clump of lava is where we are going. It's kind of near the back end of the lava biome, but right here, you can't see it very well, but there is going to be a piece of the baby planet roamed badge. And there you go. Megahorn, the destroyer of sirens. Find the Megahorn. So to get this badge, we're going to go ahead into the map. You don't have to be anything specific. 
But once you're in the map, what you want to do is go to the lava biome. It is going to be this way towards that weird mountain. I think that's the tallest mountain in the whole map. You want to go that way, but we want to stay on the right side of the lava map. It's going to be a little bit of a walk, so I'm going to go ahead, speed it up, and I'll see you guys in a few seconds. Alright, so right over here on this hill of lava, you're going to see an antenna. Go ahead, bump into it, and you'll get the Mega Horn, the Destroyer of Sirens. Old Cartoon Cat Badge. Find my TV show, if you dare. Smiley face. Alright, I accept your dare. What we want to do is go ahead over into the map as a human or a morph, and what we need to do is then go to towards the snow biome but we're gonna want to go to the left side and not go into the biome itself quite yet we're just gonna go this way and once again i'm gonna speed it up for you guys so then we don't have to spend an eternity walking so i'll see you in a few seconds Alright, so once you pass that tree, this landmass right here, go ahead and bump into the Cartoon Cat TV show. That is terrifying. Among Us Imposter. Oh god, it's the imposter. Alright, so to find the imposter, go ahead into the map, be a human or a morph. And what we gotta do is head towards the snow, look at the snow biome, and then go to the right. You might be able to see it, but there is going to be what looks like a pond over there. That is where we need to go. However, since we walk so freaking slow, I'm going to go ahead and speed it up for you guys. So I'll see you guys in a few seconds. Alright, so right here is the pond. So you can kind of see where I am. There's the snow biome and here is the edge of the map. Go ahead and bump into this yellow box and there we go. Now you can go swimming with the imposter. Who drowned Digi? Old detective. He can detect. And like a good badge detective, I will show you guys how to get it. So go ahead into the map. You can be whatever you want. Human or a morph. But we're going to then go to the waterfall. So that's going to be towards the lava biome over here where that little weird mountain is. We're going to go this way, all right? And that waterfall is going to be to the left here. But again, you guys may have guessed it. We're going to go ahead and speed this up because we are slower than a dead rock. Apparently, rocks are dead. I don't know. I didn't, I, I didn't make this discovery. Let's go ahead and speed it on up. right over here so this weird shaped landmass that is what we're looking for and you're gonna then see this on the ground go ahead bump into it. i think it's a magnifying glass very magnificent gigantic magnifying glass but you got old detective rave the black hole this is gonna be on a new game i have not been on it is called trevor creatures the trevor legends so to get this badge you can be whatever you want it doesn't matter I'm just going to go ahead and be a human. So boom. And then teleport you all to the same place. Now, if we zoom out, we want to go to the snow biome. Now, if you don't have your settings really high, you're going to want to be going this way then. So this is where we need to go. I, I don't know exactly how to show you which way. There's a little 360 view. And, you know, if you know any morphs that are fast, um, it seems like the blue and red soul morph is the fastest but that is a badge i believe or a game pass so either way you have to get that but if you do not have anything like i do i am poor i am broke only thing i have are the skittles in my back pocket and we're gonna go ahead to the snow biome i'm gonna go ahead and speed it up though a bit just so then we're not just walking super slow 
for like two minutes. So I will show you guys sped up where the badge is. All right, so once you're there, right here is what we need to go and drop down on. And simply, you will get the badge. Boom. Step on the black platform, and you got yourself Rave the Black Hole. Is that a shark? It's Goblin Shark. So to get this badge, you can be whatever you want. Now, the red and blue soul morph, it's a badge, is fastest. I think it's the fastest one in the game. But once you spawn into the game, what you want to do is go this way towards this mountain it, it kind of looks like a curved mountain a little bit i'll zoom out to show you exactly it's gonna be going this way all right but we're gonna go and walk a bit it is not too far away it's close but it's far because you move slow i think a snail is faster than this honestly like, i'm just gonna say now i think my grandma could move faster than me right now this is low despacito give me despacito boost no no okay that's fine so we'll go past this mountain or whatever this rock formation go past this little waterfall i don't know how the water is coming down since it's unless it's coming down up from the ground and then out that's interesting but once you go past it Go right over here, and you go see this blue square. I like to think of it like a little pond. The goblin shark lives in a little pond. Or maybe it is a pond. Is it a pond? No, it's just a, a square. <laughs> Don't know why. <laughs> but there we go. You got yourself. Is that a shark? Smiley face. Smiley face. Smiley face. AKA winning smile. So to get this badge, you can be whatever you want, but it is going to take a while. Now, first, let's go ahead and show you which way to go. You want to go this way over here. <laughs> oh, no. I guess I was murdered for sneezing. <laughs> but what you want to do is head this way. Now, this is going to be a very far away badge. We have to go all the way to that right corner of, that map, of this map. So, I'm going to go ahead and speed it on through. Just fast enough so that we're not here forever but slow enough so that you can see exactly where i am going so i'll see you guys in just a few seconds Alright, and right here, you can see this gray cube. Go ahead, bump into it, and you will get the winning smiley face. Small room host badge. Reward, small room host. Alright, so, to get this, you can be a human or anything else. If you have any morphs that can go fast, then go ahead and become them. But, once you're in the map, what we need to do is first go to the snow map which is going to be right over this way or the place that has the tower with the red dot now we're going to want to go to the snow map and then go to the left side of that map to the edge of the wall and as you can see i move pretty slowly so i'm gonna go ahead and speed it up Alright, so we're not there yet, but once you're here, I just wanted to be able to explain to you guys. You want to go to this side of the wall, and then right at the foot of this little hill, you're going to see what looks like like that. It's, it's, it's big teeth. That's a lot of teeth. But go ahead and bump into the morph, and you got the small room host badge. A spider? Hey guys, it's a spite. Wait, 
It's a humanoid spider. Well, we're all doomed. So to get this badge, you can be any morph or you can be a human. I'm gonna go ahead and show you as a human. Now, what you need to do is go towards the waterfall, which is gonna be right over this way where that weird shaped mountain is. Behind all that is going to be the lava biome, I guess you could say. So we want to go to the left side of that lava biome. So I'm going to go ahead and speed it up because it's going to be a bit of a walk. So I'll see you guys at the badge. There it is right over here is gonna be a spider now We're gonna become the spider. I'm a zook WTH is this so to get this badge you can be a human or any more if you want once you do that We need to then go to the where is it right over here towards this um, the lava biome now what we need to do is stick to the right side of the lava biome. Now, it is going to take a while to get there. So, I'm going to go ahead and speed it on through. Not too fast so then you can't see where I'm going. But just a little fast so then we don't have to stay here talking at the pe going at the speed of a snail. Okay? I will become speed now. Alright, so right here is where the bad's gonna be. It's gonna be behind these two lava whatever hills. <laughs> it's kind of weird. But it is gonna be right over here. There it is. In its beauty. It looks like a box. It's an Emma Zook box. Great father megaphone. It's similar to the great mother megaphone. It's Papa! He's finally come back from the store from getting milk! <laughs> Anyways, be a human or any morph of your choice. Once you do that, we want to do is go to the snow biome. So right over here where the tower is at. And this is the, what it will look like if you can't see very far away. The, this is the landscape you want to head towards. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and speed things up a bit because it takes forever to move anywhere in this game. So I'll see you in a few seconds. Alright, so here is the big tower. We want to do is go to the back side of it and then you are going to see this red square. Go ahead, bump into it, and you will then get the Great Father Megaphone Badge. Cartoon Godzilla. Find the Cartoon Godzilla code, smiley face. Alright, so we want to do is go ahead, get Kevin. He's our code breaker. He's the great, greatest code breaker. But go ahead into the map, and what we're going to do is go into the snow biome, or the snow map area. That's the one with the tower with the red light on top. Now, what you want to do is head that way to that tower, and that is where we're going to find the code. I'm going to go ahead and speed it up to the code, and then speed it up to where we need to go once we get that code. So, I'll see you guys in a few seconds. So here we are um <laughs> oh my gosh the code is right here door code 2323 2323 this code will always be the same so it does not change on each server it's always going to be that number now once you do that we're going to go ahead and go this way i'll see you guys in a few seconds All 
Alright, so here is the hole. Is a square cut out in the wall near the corner of the snow map. What you're gonna do is walk inside and go this way. Danger, lava, do not across. There's only one C, by the way. But here we go. Go ahead across the plank, like so. And then, <laughs> please give me Robux. I am poor. <gasps> Bro, don't worry. I will do Robux giveaway soon. But once you do this, right over here is going to be the keypad. 23, 20. Oh my gosh. Okay. Super blah, blah, blah. Stop. All right. So we want to just put in the code 2323 and then click enter and we'll open up the door. Go ahead and go into this blue or blue, this dark obelisk looking thing and you'll get the cartoon Godzilla tan badge. The creator's friend tan oh that's so nice that's so cool but get this badge go ahead into the map and go to the left side of the snow map so we're not going into the snow map but we're going to the left side sort of in between the lava and the snow map this part right here where my mouse is going over that is where we are going in that area all right so what you're going to be looking for is a um it, it looks like a skittle and it's red and it's round and it's glowing. That's what we are going for is the, 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 the red ball. I like to imagine it as a Skittle because Skittles are beautiful. If you don't know, I like Skittles a lot, like too much. Like I have a Skittle dispenser in my office. I know it's amazing. All right. So, what we're going for is the red ball, and it is going to be over this way. We're just going to keep walking very slowly. I guess I could have sped this up, but, you know, where's the fun in that? We get to chit-chat and talk together. Should be right over. There it is. Oh, it's a beautiful red ball. It is the glowing Skittle ball. Come to me. Come to... Wait, that's not the ball. That's a cube. No. Bob final form Bob new no final form so to get this badge we want to do is go ahead into the map once you do that we want to do them is go ahead and let me actually put my render distance up is go to the snow area or go towards it instead of going to the right we're gonna be going to the left side to this corner over here we'll go ahead and speed it up a bit so I'll see you guys in a few seconds All right, so right here, you just gotta get on the wall because the reason why is the badge is actually on the other side of the wall and it's gonna be right here towards the corner. You can kind of see this black square. What we need to do is go ahead and fall on it. Now you will probably oof and die into the world because you know, flat earth. But if you do it right, you should be able to get the badge. You just gotta be very careful. You might even be able to do it. Hey, there we go. Now it's time to die. Murray, the king of Polis. Murray was the imposter and he became the true form. Oh dear, Murray, what did you do? <laughs> so once you're in the map, what you wanna do is go ahead to the lava map, all right? And it's gonna be towards the back. So I'm gonna go ahead and speed things up a bit. And I'll see y'all in just a few seconds. Alright, so once you're here in the corner of the map, go behind this big mound of lava 
and you're gonna see red and blue crewmates who have been murdered. Got to report the body. Anyways, so everyone, that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe down below, and join the badge hunting squad today. Also, tell me happy birthday again in the comments. I want to see happy birthday. Please. Thank you. I love you guys. Check out my Roblox group, my Twitter, and my Discord. Links are in the description below. I love you all. And as always, stay awesome, stay cool, and good luck badge hunting. Bye-bye.